Today we're going to be making a fire starter using common items found at your house. Cardboard egg crate, lint from the dryer, and recycled wax. So let's go ahead and get started. So you're just going to fill out the holes with lint. You know, fill it to the top just enough to the to get to the edge here. Okay, next step is to heat up some wax and uh, just however you heat it up, just be careful not to burn yourself. And let me go heat up some wax and I'll come show you how to apply it. Alright, now that we have some melted wax, we're just going to fill it up enough to cover the lint. And remember, be careful, wax is hot and if it gets on you, it won't feel good. Go ahead and heat up some more. Alright, I got some more wax heated up. And I'm just going to coat this right here. And you can see this is coated already. So basically you want to get the, uh, the lint coated in wax. Let it cool off. And then cut it uh, for each section. Put one each one in it as a black baggie. So we'll just pour the rest uh, of what I have enough to coat the uh, enough to coat the lint. All right, we'll let that cool down, and I'll come back and show you the finished product. Okay, we're still waiting for it to cool down, but I wanted to go ahead and show you on this back side here. See, it's completely saturate, saturated in uh, wax, so that's going to give you a nice, uh, good burn. Even uh, it should work with some wet wood if you have some uh, wet wood. You don't have any other options to get it dry. This should help start it. Okay, here's the finished product. I'll baggie these up and I'll probably just put it in a big gallon baggie and put it with my camping supplies. Alright, I've got my wet limbs and pine cones here and you can see I've got my fire starter there and I'm going to light it up on the carton and we'll see how it goes. Alright, there we can see it's actually lit and it's burning slow so I'm sure it will take quite a while to actually 
flame up. But if you have some wet wood, this may be the way to go. Leave me your comments and uh, let me know if you do it and what results you get. Have a good day.